Hello, everyone. Would you be willing to leave if someone aggressively rushed towards you for the slightest reason? In this video, we continue with Road Rage, where lessons are delivered from someone who is ready to rush towards you for the slightest reason. The incident occurred when the driver of this blue car got angry at the truck behind him for driving too close. This led him to brake check the approaching truck. However, this made him quickly take the karma he created. This woman chose to use the police car to escape. The man driving this KIA was enraged because he wasn't given way while changing lanes on a crowded road. He even blamed the cars behind him. In the end though, he was the one who received a ticket. You never know who you might encounter when you decide to rage on the road, even if it's armed military personnel. A previous incident caused both vehicles to have a dispute and chase each other on the highway. Finally, the Jeep suddenly braked, causing the sedan to lose control and crash into the Jeep, flipping both vehicles. Hopefully, this video will serve as a lesson for all of us to remain calm in every situation. This road rage incident happened in Bundaberg, Queensland, Australia. The man in the red Kia hatchback got angry because he wasn't given way. It seemed like it was over when the man in the Kia left after venting his rage at the driver of the Suzuki Swift, but he suddenly sped up and rammed into the Swift. If you come across a similarly aggressive driver, give them the right of way so everyone stays safe. This road rage began when the man with a dash cam decided to overtake, after noticing the SUV driver slowing down. But this angered the SUV driver, who sped up and blocked the dash cam driver's way. He got out of his car with a baton, but dropped it in his rage. Mike was on his way to work in California when he encountered two cars chasing each other due to a previous road rage incident. Things worsened when the sedan sped up and cut in front of the pickup truck causing it to lose control and crash into another sedan in the same lane. The speed was so fast that the sedan left the highway in just a few seconds. Hopefully, this video will serve as a lesson for all of us about staying calm. The incident occurred when the man in the Nissan suddenly accelerated in the inner lane, causing his car to lose control and crash into the rear of another vehicle. The impact was so strong that his car was seriously damaged. But his karma didn't stop there when his car, right next to it, was a police patrol car that immediately arrived at the scene. The road was too crowded, but the driver in the Mercedes decided to change four lanes continuously because he did not want to miss the exit. Please proactively change lanes early before you want to leave the highway to ensure safety. Oh. 
Taxi like men. I'll suck your dick, Daddy. Instead of confronting an aggressive driver, leave peacefully to ensure your own safety. The incident occurred when the man on the motorcycle noticed the woman in the SUV using her phone and getting distracted while driving. He reminded the woman, but she chose to curse at the motorcycle. In the end, he chose to smash her side mirror before leaving. Do you agree with his actions? If you agree, comment number one. If you disagree, comment number two. The best way when you face aggressive people what, is to let bitch? them win. What, bitch? Please give a like if you think this trick of the driver not letting you pass is extremely clever. Salesman insisted the client not break because the autopilot would stop the car in time until it didn't and collided into the car ahead, waiting for traffic lights. If this video brings you new experiences to make your driving easier, subscribe to the channel and press the bell button so that every time there is a new video, you will be the first to watch it. What would you do if a child randomly threw a pie at your car? <laughs> this man's motorbike suddenly stalled, causing him to struggle to start it. But the driver in the sedan didn't have the patience to wait for him, so he decided to speed up and pass. In the end, instead of getting home on time, he destroyed his car himself. A lot of people need a reason to rush towards you, but a lot of people don't need that. The best way is to call 911 to determine right from wrong on the road, rather than rushing into each other and going home with bruises. A video recently circulating on social media was recorded during an incident in Texas. A driver driving a sedan intentionally drove into a man driving a moto behind him. The speed was too fast, causing the driver of the moto to run off the road. Worth mentioning is his reaction to the incident. I don't care. You hit them! I don't care. I got it on video too. I don't care. Double one. Yellow What is karma in road rage? Karma is when you become a fool through your own actions, caused by what you have done. Perhaps for many people, time is more important than safety. The driver of this van, in a fit of rage, rammed into an SUV because he wanted to run a red light. Finally, when he ran the red light on his own accord, the bus arrived at the same time. This man tried to run a red light and he even got angry at the man driving the oncoming SUV. So absorbed in his rage that he received karma soon after. A man on this motorbike got angry and gave the middle finger to the driver of a car turning left after carefully turning on the turn signal. Unfortunately for the cyclist, he was quickly overtaken by karma and crashed into a rickshaw with his right foot. This woman nearly rear-ended Mike's car when they both exited the highway. She even swerved in and out of traffic, cutting into other people's paths and almost hitting them. 
And this is what happened when Mike caught her up to confront her about it. So you almost f***ing ran into me off the exit of the freeway. So what? If you hit me and what? If you hit me and what? That's all you care about? All right. Okay. Because you don't know how to f***ing drive? You don't know how to f***ing drive. How about you almost rear-ended me? Yeah, I know you don't give a f*** for almost rear-ending me. All right. What? We'll see. All right, go. Come on, bitch. You can't even spit, you trash bitch. Three men clashed in a road rage incident in Bucharest, Romania. Everything seemed to be over when the man driving the black car backed up at high speed. You can't imagine how terrifying the consequences of road rage can be until you've truly witnessed it. This rage occurred between two men who had a previous conflict, resulting in severe damage to two vehicles, and the person responsible for the incident fled the scene. This video will explain why you need to stay calm in any situation on the road. You never know who or what you might be dealing with when you lose your temper and get out of your car. This man was the victim of the van driver's unwarranted rage for which he did not know the reason. The man driving this sedan suddenly stopped and became angry at the truck driver behind him because he thought the truck was going too close and could put him in danger. Ultimately, the truck driver's pepper spray helped him become more alert. This road rage incident occurred in North County. The conflict happened between two men due to a previous incident. It seemed to have ended when the black car drove away. But the man driving the red car didn't stop there and decided to give chase. The collision caused the black car to lose control and veer into the opposite lane before stopping on the grass. Fortunately, no one was injured. You never know who you might be up against when you get out of your car in a fit of road rage with a stick in hand. It is very likely that you are the recipients of karma. So the best way for you to not get into trouble is to stay calm. This rage happened when the driver encroached on the motorcyclist's lane, which also made him angry. But the way he acted made things worse. His beloved motorbike suddenly turned into a pile of scrap metal when the thought of using his motorbike to confront a car three times its weight was realized. When you have road rage, you could be the one getting yourself into trouble. Two men driving a moto attacked an SUV driver in a previous conflict, causing the SUV driver to respond by vandalizing the moto before leaving. Do you agree with the SUV driver's actions? Comment 1 if you think what he did was entirely justified. Comment 2 if you think he should have remained calm to avoid trouble. 
An earlier lane dispute had made things tense. When two men rushed out of the car and intended to attack the occupants, but the incident quickly ended with a pepper spray canister being pulled out. This driver is certainly passing traffic, and not abusing the left lane is only to pass privilege. Looks like the driver wouldn't move over to let the Kia pass, and Kia dude really didn't like that. Karma caught up with this driver when he succumbed to road rage and decided to speed up. This definitely wasn't part of his plan. Does someone else's unhappy morning make you unhappy? If you were in this situation, what would your next action be? Karma is when you get back double what you did to others. The best way to avoid getting into trouble is to find ways to avoid road rage. These two young men swerved in front of the bus, even threatened, and got angry with the driver because they thought the bus tried to hit them. The crowd in the bus witnessed the entire incident and immediately got off the bus to teach the two young men a lesson as soon as they attacked and forced the bus to stop. It seems that these two young men were drunk before driving. The heavy traffic made the man in the Hyundai angry and he decided to attack the bus because it was thought that the bus was trying to pass the yellow light, causing traffic congestion. Do you think the man's kick was strong enough to damage the large bus? The tantrum arose from the previous incident when the man overtook illegally and repeatedly check brakes with Dermot as he followed behind. Dermot honked, which made the man stop and rage, but he ultimately received a ticket. If you rage and step out of your car, you're putting yourself in danger. This is precisely why you should stay calm in every situation. This certainly wasn't in his plan when he decided to rage at the sedan. The man driving the ute became enraged and tried to ram the motorcyclist simply for the simple reason that the motorbike overtook and went in front of him. The rage intensified when both men stopped at a red light. A minor incident earlier led to a conflict among these three drivers. While everything could be resolved peacefully and for the good of both parties, the man holding the iron rod did not think about that. In the end, when the rage subsided, no one was the winner. This man entered the street while the light was red. 
He even raised his hand as if he were a god. And made the Land Rover stop so he could cross slowly. Eventually, a helping hand brought him back to reality. In her anger at the car behind her for following too closely, this woman dropped her glasses and as soon as she bent down to pick them up, she fell out of her vehicle. The man driving the Toyota witnessed the entire incident and used his car to block her now out of control vehicle. The video was shared by Dan as he was heading home after work. He came across two cars tailgating each other due to a previous incident. The driver behind who was aggressively following him received immediate karma when the car in front suddenly hit the brakes. This man suddenly flew into a rage at another man without any reason. When everything seemed to be over, he ended up receiving the karma he had created. The rage occurred when the man driving the sedan changed lanes into the lane of the man driving the moto. This made the moto rider angry because he thought it was dangerous for him. Everything seemed to be over when the man driving the moto suddenly overtook and kicked the sedan and then fell onto the street. Just one simple reason made the sedan angry. And in the end, he was the recipient of his own karma. The man driving the sedan was going slow on the road, which made the SUV driver angry. The SUV driver sped up and cut off the sedan. He got angry and check brakes the car behind him. But this also caused him to lose control and crash into the SUV in the same lane. This man driving a moto suddenly overtook and attacked the sedan without any reason. In the end, he is the one who receives the karma he created. The trailer suddenly changed lanes and cut in front of the van. This caused both of them to attack each other and curse. Luckily, everyone left and tensions did not escalate. A previous incident had caused the man to fly into a rage and kick the woman's SUV. This escalated the tension when she decided to step on the gas and speed up. Anyone in a fit of rage is frightening, even if it's a woman. This is why we should always stay calm. Do you agree that using pepper spray is an effective way to deal with road rage? Please leave your opinion below in the comment section. The man driving this sedan suddenly accelerated past the moto, trying to show off the power of his car. However, karma struck swiftly as his car lost control and veered off the road before coming to a stop. The consequences of rage are never part of your plan, so the way to prevent it is by staying calm and respectful. Klein was driving along Sardis Road in Murraysville, Pennsylvania, when he encountered a traffic jam caused by a man raging at an elderly woman driving a sedan. His rage ended when the police arrived and took him to the station. This man became enraged with Letitia while she was driving to her office. 
The reason for his rage was that he thought Letitia was going too slow and blocking in front of him, even though the next lane was clear. The fact was that Letitia was driving at 60 miles per hour, but he still thought it was not fast enough, so he overtook and screamed at Letitia. Ultimately, in his effort to speed up and overtake her, he lost control and ran off the road. There was no observation when he changed the lanes, but this was what caused his anger. And in the end, that anger taught him a lesson. Our only goal when traveling on the road is to get to the finish line safely, not to win a bout of road rage. So if you can forgive each other's small mistakes, please do this. The rage came from the man driving the pickup truck when Logan was on his way home from work. Logan didn't even know what made the man angry, but he pulled up beside a car in the right lane and then slowed down. Logan decided to stay calm and left safely. In the end, he looked about 17 years old, and the reason he did this was that he felt threatened by an old man in a Jetta car. Sometimes slowing down for a few seconds can save you a lot of money. It seemed like he was going crazy and using the little sedan to try to damage the big bus. Definitely not a great idea. In any situation, running a red light is a mistake. And it's even worse when you run a red light right in front of the police and almost cause an accident. Raymond was on his way home from his shift in Santee, California, when a Toyota Tacoma suddenly cut him off and checked brakes him for no reason. The speed was too fast, causing Raymond to lose control and crash into the car of workers who were repairing the road. Fortunately, no one was in the car and everyone quickly ran from the incident. The man driving the unruly sedan tried to cut into his lane by encroaching into the opposite lane. He even flew into a rage when he wasn't given way. He got out of his car and approached aggressively, seemingly intent on resolving his anger with his fists. But he was immediately hit by pepper spray. This unruly man decided to block the entire busy road during rush hour just to settle a minor dispute from an earlier incident. Not stopping there, he even challenged everyone present despite everyone's advice to him. but this is what caused him to receive bad karma. Bullies on the street receive retribution as soon as they decide to block the entire road. The man driving the Nissan pulled onto the shoulder and had previously tried to merge when there was no space. The story ended with him having to pay $2,000 in repair costs because the insurance company refused to cover the damages. There are people who love supercars, and there are those who seek to destroy them. Fortunately, the police arrived quickly enough to ensure that the situation was handled properly. An earlier road dispute led to this man throwing a milk bottle at a truck driver's windshield. The reason was that the truck driver had started to slow down just so this man could speed past, but he assumed the truck driver brake checked with him. What would you do 
if you were the person driving that moto. Please share your behavior in the comments section below. The rampage occurred when this man parked his car opposite Dabin's car in a previous situation. Dabin decided to drive across the street to note down the driver's license plate number, but this made him furious. This video will explain to you why it's important to have more tolerance when road rage sets in. This man will receive no karma at all as he chooses to leave in peace but he chose to make the rage more intense. Surely winning a road rage battle is not something desirable when traveling on the road. Our most important goal is to reach our destination safely. This rage happened in Mexico, when the car in front suddenly breaks while everyone is moving normally. This caused the man driving the Nissan to get angry and get out of the car and rush towards the gray car to deal with his rage. The man driving the Toyota tried to illegally overtake and then hit Henry's car going in the opposite direction. But the thing is that he was the one who was angry with Henry. If you were Henry, what would you do in this situation? Please leave your behavior for everyone to refer to.